the first person that says twa, they don't even have to get twine out. If they say this baler also does twa, I'm gonna right in the mouth. Hey, what's going on, guys? Today we are raking uh, the hay that we made the other night. Uh, my father-in-law is still at work right now. When he gets home, he uh, is going to jump in the round baler and we're going to roll this stuff up. Looking at the weather earlier this week, it's pretty, pretty comical. And I apologize for the, for the vibrations. Maybe we'll come down here. So looking at the weather, looking at the weather uh, earlier this week, it had five days with 0% chance of rain. Uh, mid 80s it was it was gonna be gorgeous of course we get to Wednesday where there's a zero percent chance of rain and it's sprinkled I mean not even not even enough to like knock the dust down kind of sprinkle uh, maybe sprinkle for 30 seconds but regardless it wasn't even supposed to rain and then that's what we get right now uh, doubling up on windrows uh, but I do have the outside wheels up so you can see that right there I have both outside wheels up right now and the reason that I'm doing that is uh, this hay was pretty high so I don't want to have monster windrows uh, so I'm taking a little bit off the edges probably end up losing I don't know, four foot or so. But uh, yeah, so wow, I'm really terrible at trying to hold the phone and talk at the same time and drive. But uh, yeah, that's where we're at right now. You see, it's pretty dusty. The hay's good and dry. Uh, so stick with us. I won't be bailing tonight, but I will try to get some shots uh, using the drone of the round baler in action. Uh, I got my wife's cousin Chuck is coming down tonight. Uh, we're gonna run down to the neighbors and get their round bale wagon and hopefully we can uh, move some of these bales as we make them too. So stick with us, should be fun. And uh, heck yeah, let's roll some up. guys so we're on the last field I'm wrapping up here uh, my father-in-law came home and jumped in the tractor he's been bailing he's almost got one field done uh, and then he's got these last two to go the hay up on this upper side as you can see by the size of the windrows is pretty high finish raking. I'm going to run to the neighbors, pick up the round bale wagon, hook up the loader on this tractor. Hook up the loader to this tractor. There's a guy in a golf cart right there. Anyways, um, and then go load up bales and take them back to uh, back to the barn. Look out. Alright, time to put her in transport.
got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen bales out of this one field. But looks like my father-in-law is broken down. Going on. All good in the hood. Twine. Twine issue. Or also known as Devil Spaghetti. I swear. The next baler I buy brown baler will be a net wrap and the first person that says twine they don't even have to get twine out if they say this baler also does twine i'm gonna right in the mouth right in the mouth I'll, 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 i mean that, that's like that's like cussing it's like legit cussing what do you know devil spaghetti all over the ground right there yep Right there, yep. Stuff's everywhere. I liken using twine to getting a haircut. You need to get a shower afterwards because the little hairs get everywhere and it's super uncomfortable. Having a twine baler, just like that. Identical. All right guys, so what we got here, uh, we're unloading hay right now. Off this bale wagon. We're stacking all this hay <clears throat> close to the barn this year. Last year I ran, up, I ran out of spots to stack hay, so I ended up stacking it up on top of the hill. And I had a mess with Line. So, I'm going to try to bring all this hay down here. That guy you're seeing right there is my wife's cousin, Chuck. He's been giving us a hand the last couple times we made hay. And let me tell you, I really appreciate the help. Because we are moving in a groove in the night. father-in-law and we swapped out 806s the front end on the, the one right in front of you it's a little a little squirrely but uh yeah we swapped out 806s i talked to my father-in-law we got 46 bail out of these uh <clears throat> well let's see it's two and three is five one six Three is nine, so nine acres. Now I got 46 bale, so not great. Now you can watch me load this bad boy.
right, that's it for the first field. Two more to go. Oh, this is field one and two. Tell you what, this round bell wagon sure beats the snot out of taxiing them two at a time. Once again, the neighbors come through in a pinch. Don't know what I'd do without my neighbors. Very bumpy. Chuck can't see me. Look out for the big holes, Charles. There's bumps in this part of the field that'll loosen fillings in your teeth. Just stay there. Real bumpy, just stay there. That's it guys, we're done for tonight. It's uh, uh, about 8.45 and uh, yeah, made just about 50 bales out of this, uh, I think it was nine acres total. Not a huge amount of hay. Those fields are uh, pretty subpar for what I like. But uh, yeah, so hey, if you like what you see, I'd appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel and uh, Follow us on all social media platforms. Till next time.